trade bait. You could have got everything you traded away to get Jared Goff. After after he made it to the Super Bowl, you say, hey, we got this great young coach. We believe in this young coach. We think he can coach up. Look at the quarterbacks that have gotten paid because of of Sean McVay. Mm -hmm. Like, this dude can coach up any quarterback and make them look good. So, you... If you traded Jared Goff, you could have got your two first-round picks, you know, and your three other picks that you traded away to trade up to that number one spot. You could have got all that back and put Blake Bortles, you know, compare Blake Bortles and Ryan Tannehill. You give a beastie running back to Blake Bortles and a pretty good offensive line, and he's performing exactly the same as Jared Goff. Maybe a little bit worse, but chances are pretty close to exactly the same. And you're only paying him $8 million a year instead of 29 or whatever yeah. he's at now. Blake Bortles was Ryan Tannehill a couple years ago, folks. It's the same <laughs> situation. <laughs> he was he was in the AFC Championship game. In case we didn't remember, they were one bad ref call over a Patriots fumble that they should have taken back for a defensive touchdown would have iced the game away from being in the Super Bowl. 